Perugia is known for two things, chocolate and literally fighting the Pope at every possible opportunity. That's right, Perugia was based. Today, we're gonna to take this to the extreme by annexing the Pope and fighting everyone else as well, because I imagine this place has a lot of pent up rage. If you wanna see me continue the Perugian conquest, be sure to like the video and subscribe. If this video gets enough support, I'll take the seething mess of Italians across the Mediterranean. Right lads, Perugia is a nation that, yeah, you've not really thought about, but it exists. And today we are playing as it, and it has its own mission tree, uh, which is all about, well, developing a little bit, uh, the struggles that the Perugians historically had with the papacy. Um, yeah, and it looks like a pretty decent enough mission tree and an interesting enough nation with a custom idea set uh, to make me want to play it. So we start out with production efficiency and national tax modifier. Not the greatest, but we'll definitely take that. Some fort defense plus 20%, which is actually on the higher end. I think only Afghanistan has higher with 25%. National rest minus one, basically not even an idea. Tolerance to true faith isn't terrible. Republican tradition plus 0.3, because we are a republic, is very good. Missionaries plus one, depends where we expand. Morale advice plus 10% could be higher, but not bad. Undersized demands minus 20%. Maybe we stack that. Who knows? And then we get trade efficiency. So not the strongest of idea sets, but we do start out as an Italian signora, signoria. <laughs> right. So starting off, we can only declare war in a month's time. Get to our force limit, which should trigger or missions, or at least put us on the path to it. We get humiliation on people state and Urbino and get prosperity in the state of Lazio, Umbria. Maybe we hold on then? Do we take this stuff? Stability, 5,000 manpower. Hmm. Okay, well let's see, would anyone port our independence? Savoy, Castile, oh Castile, sorry. Savoy, Provence and Venice. All right, let's give those a go. Here's what we'll do. We will scornfully insult. We'll set up our estates. <laughs> oh, Papal Emissary. I did not know that we started with that. Here's yearly papal influence. Well, the, sure. Okay. Why not? We've got to decide if we're going to be good little Catholics, because I'm feeling a bit rebellious. Don't take that out of context. Oh, God, I just realized how you could... No, nope, move on, don't address it. Hurry. Uh, yep, yeah, okay, so we're going to get uh, military power. Uh, we're going to go ahead and grab ourselves religious diplomats. Oh, we do immediately gain 20 prestige, which is going to be very useful. There's a scornful insult. Now you will support independence. We won't support it. We won't support as well, because we need to declare war before they get any major allies okay they get two and yeah, love savoy as well ward save in 1393 in perugia there were bloody battles between rival factions ah cool okay so what does that give us glorious expansion impact minus okay i'll do that immediately or at least one mercenary and we get for 50 years mercenary power and mercenary maintenance and then if we own rome we get permanent claims so this is more of an expansionist sort of thing ward statement okay we can get a station advisor i don't want to go because everyone starts friendly to the pope i think it's worth waiting just another month we're gonna wait another month it gets another alliance so it's Bologna, Saluzzo, and Silly versus the boys. We should be absolutely fine. Okay, well, I'll take a 5-4. And here we can do a military campaign. There's like, okay, so this is part like historical. Like here it's like, it shows you the history and why it's there. And then this one's like more narrative. As soon as the whole world, as soon as the whole company was assembled, standing in a wide circle around them. Rakio. A curious conversation began. The marshals began to murmur slowly. First one joined and then another, until they were all chanting together in a long, rising and falling rhythm. Now loud on one side of the ring, now dying away, there was rising to a great boon on the other side. Don't really need a manpower on the stability right now. I kind of want to grab the prosperity after I finish stuff. Because I think I already have claims. Yes. Basically now, we are straight against Urbino and then we have to flee. Uh, Ferrara, can I have access please? Go! Run! I mean, it's not it's not ideal, but we still have our thousand troops. Plus <laughs> statue and restraint of appeal. Yeah, screw it. Why not? Terrible idea, objectively, but doing it either way. We also lost our entire army. But that was going to happen. Like, there was not really much of a chance that that would... The issue here being that losing these allies, because they kind of need to keep... Go on, one for that. Yeah, how many do we have here? That could have been a lot worse. <laughs> Got a load of little allies with us as well. Lorraine, Naxos, it's great. The Bino's troops gone. But we in the Empire. We are not. So I'm putting relations with you to see if we can't... We need to join the Empire before we do this war. I think that's important. We'll get some sort of defense from the emperor against like external nations. If I say that I am threatened, I can't do that. Need allies. Okay, who would be likely to ally me? Navarra. This is not a good start. Anyone bigger than Navarra? Oh dear. <laughs> I'm gonna give myself a little bit of extra income. I'm going to need it. All right, now we, we basically have 100%, but I need to get four rats probably. I mean, what percentage do I have? I have 4%. Yeah, they're all gonna hate me. Unless I give over Urbino and Ancona, which honestly might be an option. But first, let's join the empire. I'll have to leave in a bit anyway, because of the whole, you know, Kingdom of Italy. Okay, join the empire. Join the HRE. Give us a bit of defense. Okay, Venice would stick with us here. Savoy like us. Who wants to know. Venice would stay allied. Okay, so I have to decide. I can't keep all of them happy. 
I have to decide which ally I'm going to drop. And I think it has to be Provence, right? Devoy is in a good position. Provence is not. Well, technically, I could take a stand against Venetians. I, mean, I think staying out of the Venetians is a good idea whilst I swallow the rest of... What I did was I gave Saluzzo in a separate piece to uh, Savoy. And then this way, I can keep everyone happy. Separate piece silly first, so I can get... I can get 0.86 of a ducat. Wonderful. Lads, economy secured. Yeah, Abino cuts me off. I think I'm going to give Manco enough. Give it cash. Let's grab ourselves. Oh, I will no longer exist after all. Does that give me Abino? It's either going to give me Abino or Venice Abino. So, you know, we shall see. First things first. Almost forgot about you. A little bit of extra prestige. Well, annexation. This should give us everything we need. Bino becomes our vassal. Wonderful. We get paper, 15 paper influence. 75% cheaper. Now, I am going to be keeping it. Keeping Rome, even though it's a horrible one. Occupation of Rome. The restraint of appeals and occupation of Rome means that that's not going too well for us. Probably should, have, should not have increased my stability because I knew that this was going uh, We will royal marry the Savoyards. Now things have settled. Anyone like the ally me? There's a resounding no. All right, let's work on keeping our existing allies then. Permanent claims. City of Ancona. I definitely need more troops to fight off the uh, impending rebels. I'm also loath to increase my stability whilst I still have over it. Focus on that first. Venkles one out. I'll royal marry them as well. It might seem kind of strange, but I'm going to take out some burger loans. I need to keep building up my army. Then I can do this. Sell myself prosperity. 50 years, form progress growth, local prosperity growth. I believe that's just here, right? Go to trade, send cheaper, nice, and pay off some loans. Don't have any loans. Okay, perfect. Can we settle down for a while? Terranism, virtues of politia. Did these guys rule for life? No, oh, it's every like 10 years. Really? Get that yearly rule. That seems a bit redundant, but we're going to need it later on. Rival Naples. They're all with England. Expansion actually equal to have a claim on you. Rome is now a core province of ours. We make a decent amount of money. I'm not paying my troops. I do feel like going against the Neapolitans is not a bad idea when we have a five forward general. And I've got a siege guy. Okay. Back up to zero. Three. He's got no allies. I know oh, yeah, he's gonna get allies soon. For this war at least. hundred years war. Okay, three companies to shore up our numbers. Leave behind a thousand men. The rest, it's 13 against 13. Okay, I have to help out Abina. Didn't want to, but I had to. The last of the incursion. Did not expect him to uh, attack me in the mountains. Trying to attrition me? I mean, that's fine. We're dealing with way more damage than we're taking. Keep baiting onto that province. We've got manpower. I'm like immediately going to take this opportunity to go and defend Rome and then get back. Go. Okay, that's risky, but it had to happen. They were going to beat me in the siege. I like that the AI is actually trying something instead of just sitting there and dying. Their own wedding happened, so that usually is going to be followed up by them going after. He's going in again. Is it Napoli? Let's let him move on to Napoli. And this should be it. So now I can chase him down. Okay, he's probably going to Salento. Oh no, he's going to Barry. Okay, weird place to no longer need the free company. And there it is. What did I have to take? I have claims on Brutzi, Napoli, Salerno. Risky, but I could take it. I'm 10 did. Is it worth it for a five development province though? I think anyone else would join. Dead, I could get war reps. I think it'd be more valuable at this point. I mean, I can still... Yeah, but they get... Okay, guaranteed by Venice. This works. War in Campania. Where you enables to not exist. Gives us development goal. Blinding start though for a uh, good old Perugia. Coalition is unfortunate, but not... Asborg, Salzburg, and Trier are the, uh, the ones that we can ally. I don't know why I said it like that. We're larger. France is minus 55, 84. Here's Austria are friendly towards us. Very useful for expanding the empire. Debt you as friendly? Oh, nope, they're no longer funny. Well, it was nice. So where's the people state these days? We've paid two of our loans. I don't have any left. Even if I got rid of my alliance with Venice, we've got to get rid of Florence's alliance. Because usually what you do is you declare war with their ally, right? But unfortunately, their ally is Hungary, who's also allied to Chris. So they created a little punk box. So stability. You were useful to get rid of the papal state and get me another province. Some of these elections are so long. I always want to go to Napoli. Miltech, Austria. Hmm? Hmm? Well, marry you. Because of the trust. Okay, well, what if I... I do to get rid of me. If I scornfully insult your enemies, that being... France or Burgundy or the Austrian Burgundy is the least offensive for me. It's because you got tech, didn't you? What the hell happened? My navy strength is an issue, apparently. Also trigger these Spolatini separate. Can't farm a uh, advisor. They farm forage for. Probably is a more accurate term. Uh, an advisor, a diplomatic reputation, please, if you don't mind. Nope, that's morale of navies. It's not very useful to me. Fortunately, means I have to get rid of this guy. Is it? Right here. Ships are going to turn up and Austria is going to be wowed. Oh my god, it actually worked. <laughs> oh, the, the two skilled guys gone. Okay, well, I just spent like 30 ducats for no reason. Reputation is a lot better, especially given people have left the coalition against me, which is nice. Plan is to go off to Siena. And, and there's no point in me going to the Balkans because the only point was to go and get the gold mine. But the Ottomans apparently have decided that they're going to get the gold mine today. So that's fun, you know, good for them. Nice in Roma. Elections, so we can get that 666. Let's start going after this lot. Gain stability. Beautiful. Good things do happen to good people. Doesn't have any troops. Fighting someone? No. Where are your troops? The Provence? Yeah, Provence is completely dead. Siege of Siena.
Vienna. I'd rather not lose any shit to... I also don't want to get blockaded, so it's probably worth staying in. Yep. Would like reparation from the... Uh... Okay, we've got to leave the Empire and somehow keep our alliance. So we're going to leave the Empire. <clears throat> but downside to stay in the Empire as an Italian nation is miserable. Did anyone actually stay? All right. In your own time, mate. Just just surrender. Anytime. Anytime if I like it. Oh, all right. No professionalism. Why not? I don't have much going for you, so I'll just take your money. You give me a trade path. No? So I'll just sell any capital for a while. I don't need um, any sort of your know, cardinal seats because, you know, well, me and the Pope, we don't exactly see eye to eye. Seeing as I kicked him out of his house and I'm occupying his palace. It's lovely. Don't get me wrong. I don't regret it. Just these war reps, transfer trade power. We're gonna embrace ourselves the Renaissance, and we get the conquest because it's proper tradition, which we desperately, desperately need. Also get great patrons because we embrace the Renaissance. Yeah, 25 years of value for some advisors and a skill too, so it's something cheaper. Nice. And here we need a university. Tunis is a good rival. Fighting the Ottoman. Fucking Nick Corsica. The French would ally us. It may come as a shock, but I think I'm gonna play tall a little bit while developing my nation. Take full advantage of uh, linked generations. Like as a free city, and then it's the Temple of Cathedral in Perugia and developed, and then they get no. Country of Latin culture group. Its capital in the Italy region has a larger army or total development. So it's pretty much everyone around. Boleto and Tarasi. Better center of trade as well as Napoli. What I was going to say is that I need to go after Ferrara. I think our time with the Venetians is coming to an end. Uh, if I want to marry you, can I you? Perfect. I feel comfortable enough to try and annex you. Then we could try and do something over here. Hmm. My plan as it stands is to try and get Austria in the war with me. Yeah, let's try and get Austria in the war against with me against like Genoa, and then I can attack Florence and Hungary, break up that line, so then I can attack Hungary. Ah, you're all with the Ottoman. Oh, this is gonna shoot our trust. Um we'll spend our favors to try and stop that from happening. Trying to stop the Austrians from not not uh Breaking our alliance with us it means insulting the breaking our alliance with Venice. Okay, uh, I don't know if the audio picked it up, but outside my house there was a bit of a kerfuffle. I'm not sure what it was. Uh, it appeared that someone had stolen from a store or something and procured several items of food, some of which is now smashed outside my front door. Uh, I opened the door to ask what was going on. There was a lot of screaming directed at me as well. I'm not sure why. Both sides seemed to think that I was taking the other person's side when all I wanted them to do was. Stop smashing things against my door. Uh, I feel like that's kind of a reasonable request. Uh, but hey, apparent, apparently not everyone was angry at me. How that happened, I don't know. So then I had this guy and this girl who were uh, like dressed in like the, the store uniform yelling at me. I had the dude who, was, who uh, allegedly stole things yelling at me. How was I the bad guy in that situation? I just came out and told him to stop yelling because it was disturbing my dog. <laughs> I thought I was going to get jumped by all three of them. <laughs> However, as luck would have it, uh, uh, the, 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 they, they all left behind Special K. Like, I like Special K. So, I don't know if I'm a thief now, but they everyone just left this on the ground afterwards. It's an unopened box of syrup, so I thought I'd take it for my time. <laughs> I was disturbed. I just, it was just going to stay there. What I wanted to do was throw it out. I don't know what store they worked at. They left. So, I, I, I will give this Special K a new home. Oh, God. I just wanted to record some like YouTube videos, and instead, I'm... <laughs> I'm here, <laughs> just out here, like stealing special K. It's, it's gone, I'm a criminal now. I also got you from a mission. Gain some cogs, it's actually kind of useful. Okay, so we want to land some troops here on Corsica. The war with, uh, with Genoa in the Crimean conquest of, of Genoa. You don't have claims, you haven't moved any ships, so assume you're not coming. You're on Multic 6, so am I. That's hills, did not put. The main thing here is I need to fight the Austrians to join <laughs> the wrench in my plans. Any other allies I could pick on? Just for Genoa. Okay, if I attack Venice, so you'll come in, right? And then I can fight. I don't think I clicked the button. In my defense, my head was a little bit elsewhere. I can't wait for them to come knocking on my door again, demanding their special K back. I'll give it to them. There's like, I'll, I'll, there's a shoe outside. Is what I'm gonna take a photo so I can put it in the video. All right, that photo should be popping up on screen now. But yeah, there's just there's seasoning. There's a, a, a wayward shoe. I don't know who from. They're also using my bin to fight each other. I don't, I don't, I, like, I just want them to stop messing with my stuff. Because <laughs> I heard like banging in the bins and yelling, so I had to check, and as anyone would. The three people started on me. Make sure I have a claim on Lucca. Uh, it's a bit different as well, because they're a free city, so it's not going to be enough just to attack Naples, and then uh, they have to like actively be unable to accept the call. Rival the Neapolitans, because if I rival the Hungarians, then the, the Austrians will death. That might be the most interesting thing I've ever seen. If I keep my alliance with Austria and France, I attack the Hungarians, who are no longer allied to Austria, presumably because Hungary is allied to France. But Florence and Hungary, ideal, because then I can get rid of the alliance with, with, uh, with Florence. This is perfect. Downside is I have to fight 
much more than uh, I probably can. But that's okay. Gems, excellent. Florence is pretty much already dead. Oh, no, don't block me. How have you gotten away with fighting against Ferrara, Burgundy, and the Ottomans? And Italian Wars happened. Hey, it's, it's that guy. What's up, dude? Oh my god. I'm, so, I'm, I'm sorry to keep on, like, referencing it. I just, I find it, I find it what happened uh, is so, like, Baffling. They're all quite small individuals, so I wasn't like fearing for my life. Um, it was always nice. So, so it, was just, it was just more, I was just confused as to why everyone was yelling at me. <laughs> the Alliance thing is kind of nasty. Um, you have a lot of troops. Unfortunately, my good general died. Rara can I have access. Thank you. And anything else for access? Why can't I go to Friuli? Is Trent in this war? Sure, you could not reinforce your, your friends there. Trent would do stuff. If I went around the back, he still would block by this war. I need to take this war. It's actually a really important war. Could not blockade me. That'd be fantastic. Government reform. Temple right. Balance of power or curse of power. Do that one. Never do that one. Looks to me like Austria is about to declare war on Venice. Please, come on. Oh, come on. Last idea set in 72. I go through the craft guide is rare that I ever get the chance to do that. Ah, that's nice of the Ottomans, isn't it? What I'm gonna do is start pumping. I don't, I'm not gonna need this lot for you. Um, and I have betrayed several allies. See, ideally, I'd like to keep them both. Hungarians are fine, the Ottomans, I think. Oh, the Bohemians are allied to the Hungarians, I think. Keep both those in. All right, keep both those in. Keep, I, want pe I want the people to know how badly I messed that up. I want the people to know that I tried to say that the Bohemians have allied the Ottomans. And for some reason, I kept on saying the Hungarians had been attacked by the Ottomans, which is true, but I already said that. And the, the, the uh, Hungarians are allied to... I just want to bolt a special K. I don't think we can win that. We're there already. Siege ability. Oh, made that whole maneuver redundant. Okay. So let's go ahead and get. I want to humiliate. Go. And that should stop the Austrians from wanting to break uh, their alliance with me every 15 seconds. Oh, just need a little stability. Taking these two promises isn't the worst idea in the world. I'm going to give it to Urbino. He can handle it. Give us a nice front against the. Uh... Oh, 777 ducats. Nice. Neapolitan separatists. And we have Corsicans. Still got some Corsicans. More important, I can finally upgrade these. Build some buildings. Oh no, the Bohemians aren't allied to the uh, Ottomans. So that entire point was redundant. It's just the. Uh... I triggered a massive dog pile on Hungarians. Second Brent. French. Brett's on unification. It's getting worse, chaps. When did that happen? 20 years ago, and I missed it. 20 years ago. Who are you allied to? Yeah, the Moroccans actually did it. But then you lost. How long ago was that? That was recent as well. There's no way that Portugal survives. Oh, hello. Port defense, which is nice. We've got to think next steps. Fortunately, there's not a shortage of options for me to attack. A lot of things happened that I just clicked through. When did Poland do that? So, Venice, Hungary, and Poland all came. It was an ally Poland. Yeah, screw it, why not? Get rid of the access. Sorry, I've been saying that for literal. Yeah, it's it's time for us to break our lines with Savoy. Draw what Burgundy, which means I can Why can't I fight? Okay, there you go, I can't. It's not to say, what? what's that about? Power's low to stack that up a bit. Brunswick finds themselves at war with the Emperor. Oh, hang on. They've brought in their buddies. Great, an embezzler. Banner against the Ottoman. The Ottoman subjugation. Of oh, they're allied. Okay. I was about to say, why Why am I not involved in this? Uh, let's grab ourselves the aggressive expansion reduction. We want stability to be at least three. Completes a mission and a mission date still. Local tax modifier in that region. Rugi has a workshop for stuff as well. Choosing a side, we're going to need to have land for that. This one, prosper pros prosperity station in Roma and Teresina. I like how I could be getting favors by, you know, going after Burgundy. That's a good idea. Let's do that. I'm sitting here like, hmm, maybe. Maybe I should curry favors. Also, <laughs> this war for man, take Hane out, but it's, he already released them. We're just going around pillaging people, man. We helped by 8%. It's literally 100% war's going on. Okay, we've got 6.8 prestige. Huge guy, killed two. Hey, nice. Okay, I'm not gonna click it now, because I'm gonna get rid of this guy. France wouldn't come in. Very important. We are wood. Well, the whole point of this was to call in the Austrian. If I declare war on Savoy, they're like, we won't join because we're the Holy Roman Empire. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> this has nothing to, be, to, to do with being the Roman Emperor, man. Making excuses, being a bad friend. Build some buildings, develop a little bit. You know how it is. Go, go, go. We need to occupy every province. If I occupy it, can they get the... God, I hope not. Could be really bad. I can't even attack Lucca for war school. Well, Abino's doing it a bit. Um, I mean, I can't imagine that they're going to be too happy about that one. <laughs> we're going to form a union or just annex them. You're welcome, Naples. Does complete our next mission. It does. Thousand sigils. We need to take Ancona and we need to have Tuscany. We get glory to Etruria. Another merchant. Why not? Do what? Do over here. Transfer trade power. Oh, of course. You're still in the war. Wait, you're still in the war. Eh. We'll go. Development do we have? We need 60 more development. The Neapolitans don't really want to revolt. They'd rather be under me than the, uh, the Austrians. Better Italian than German. That's what I always say. No, Cortuba. I didn't get that far. <laughs> We're bringing him back. Right. Get ready for war, boys. We're bringing back the Aragonese. I'm not having the the the, uh, the Cortuvans. I'm not having this. Not today, buddy. Not today.
these long elections are really killing me because the main thing that you, you do for a uh, republic, right, is the re-election. Um, that's the main advantage. Uh, but the, the elections being so long means that we always max out Republican tradition. There's no point in, in having it as high as I have it. Um, it's just a bit rust up with the Austrians. That I understand. Poland, well, France, Seal, Portugal, Savoy. If I had 10 more favors of Austria, I could already had clips here. I have troops here already. I'm barrage that. It is mountains. And that's why. Probably the French can take on the Castilians. Launch ourselves in here. Troops aren't terrible. Couldn't really be fighting in the mountains when they have a superior general. Uh, it's a Nona. I'm a bit of a legend though, so. Oh, he took Siena. I don't want to re-elect this guy. He is separatism. Brilliant. Okay, now we want to trigger this. I'm going to give him plus one in each category. Also going to give us goods for use. Notion to the Pope. Why would I do that? Why add navy? The amount of galleys we have. I don't want to lose too many ships. Can I go espionage? Probably makes the most sense given that we're in a... Oh, screw it. I'm going economic in about two years. Okay, maybe we focus on defending your land. Anything else? I've integrated them. Choosing a side. This is morale of armies. This thing gives us... that we get nor heaven, not hell. What the hell is this? No idea what any of that meant. But we did it. Paris has fallen. <laughs> the, the Castilians are chasing me. Okay, bro, please. Really a 4-0. Warned by the Ottomans. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I thought France would uh, would fare a bit better than this. They are going to be peacing out at some point and leaving me hard. Attached to me and we'll do it. Now, we could probably trap them in... I just got that guy. What are you leaving for? Ah, uh, that's a massive battle. Place of victory, we trap them, which means we should be able to stack them. Right, surely you can deal with that. I'm going to run now and deal with these guys. Oh, just before we do, though, grab ourselves Pike and Shot as a 3-3. Three, three. We have 2-2, two, two, but we did it. This is there. There we go. Nevis the kind of wants a voice. Ottoman Separatists. Nice. Really? <laughs> Why not? If I take a province myself, maybe I can. In a fleet, I can take and patch. Please go, go somewhere else. I'm taking the mountain fort. Clear Portugal out war. Life a bit easier. Government mm -hmm. cost we can stack. We get national arrest minus one. War's been going on a while. About seven years. That's a good peace deal. We take the islands, so we have a dominant control over Italy. And then we take Malaga to release. Welcome back, buddy. Told you we'd do it. And now we're a kingdom. Rival Venice. Real reason why I would You're probably still... Oh, I made Aragon loyal by mistake. The reason I picked uh, Monaco is because there's mountain fort here. So now it's a good master reputation. So you can't see my diplomatic reputation anyway. Usually it's over here. You've got country modifiers here under diplomatic reputation. Oh, there it is. Annex subjects over extensions to occupation of Rome. Yeah, four more years of that. All oh, right, rather slowly to start, unfortunately. Oh, Florence joined the empire. Ah! Oh, that makes life tricky. That makes life very difficult. That's fine. That's fine. It's whatever. It's okay. I didn't, didn't want to fight anyone anyway. It's probably the Mamluks are as dominant as they are. I'm not dominant. No, it seems a bit insane. But we have Austria and Poland ready. And it's a strong Poland and a weak Ottoman who haven't even taken out Atkinu or Karaman. They haven't even cleaned up the Turkish miners. They're going after Crimea. They don't have any significant gaps. Just stick together, please. Stick, stick, stick together, please, chaps. See how you're spreading out? That's, that's not real. Why would you rival me right now? I'm helping you. Attack the Ottomans. Hey, yep. Uh, the Ottomans are pretty... Uh, pretty handy. Uh, thanks, Austria. Everyone's marching away from me. All of my bank manpower. I'm gonna have to stop dipping into my professionalism. Okay. I dodged death there. Okay, I personally have 20,000. The Austrians also have about 15,000. So There's about 35,000 troops here. That was not a sure thing. We almost lost that several times over. So we have the independent army. Why? Ottoman army just appears out of nowhere. We've lost a lot of troops. Just in Bohemia. Because usually when you fight the Ottomans... Okay, nice. That's a victory. Then usually when you fight the Ottomans, you have Hungary alongside. <laughs> not the case here. They've been by that balls we've lost pretty much every battle we fought <laughs> we're not going to navy around here somewhere yeah it's right there well, if they're up north it might give us a chance to nope can't let Zagreb fall can't let the Austrians fall the Austrians already fell oh my god it's so painful <laughs> Fortunately, the Lithuanians have been pushing eastwards at the same time, but like, hey, what fun, not anywhere else. The Ottomans have the siege ability for another 10 years, so please let me get this fort. Yeah, go over there. There you go. There you go, Poland. Sheer force of numbers, chaps. Fuck you on that siege. There you go. Right, this should be it. Hideously overstacking, but that's, that's just to prevent them. Here's what I'm going to do. Okay, I was trying to hide my navy, and instead I may have killed it. God, the attrition. Come on, please, just take the capital. Take guns at the double. I'm going to go for a suicide run. With the assumption that we'll win this, then we can get across the strait. Put my ships over here as a sacrifice. We've made it. Okay, and so across the strait. Jesus. Cordoba, I do need the men. Paso wants white peace. Ozan, you able to get to them? Yeah, I can. Cool. Right, look, do your own thing. Do your own thing. Don't rely on me for a sec. Go and stand in Ramazan. That should get him out. For a weak ally for the Ottoman. That will fight that navy. Okay, got more ships coming. Union Sea. Okay, we're going to hide again. The Separatists. Oh, there we go, Poland. And uh, not, not there we go. Not, not there we go. Particularists. They immediately barraged it and left. 
Perfect. The Aegean, which will give me the opportunity. I've been waiting for. Barrage this. Ships are all... Well, I'm actually... We haven't lost... We didn't lose any. Nice. So many things popping up that I've just been ignoring. Okay. Adaptive combat terrain. Got an advisor there. Kind of want to seize executive powers. I'm not a fan of this government type. It does kind of fly in the face of Perugia, though, if we switch out. I don't really want to. Screw it. Let's go. Oh, then I do it every time. Is there a knack? Like, I'm tempted to go down... Yeah, screw it. Clerical state. Uh, map recovery speed. Commercial mission. That makes sense. Missionary strength. Click on pause there. Ban temple rights. Get bevved up. 333. Giovanni's out there. Get this mountain fort at all costs. Pull them off of that siege. Even if we lose, it's going to be worth it. Oh, they won the siege. Why I decided to just actively work against my own interests. This siege has been going on so long. Now everyone's declaring war because the emperor won't get involved. Oh, Venice. <laughs> That's just better for me. My own guys are going to be peacing out soon. We need to be wary of this. I've already got troops here. I actually not this entire time. I'm using them. You know the rules if the navy leaves. Ooh. Ooh, our entire navy's breaking. Okay, we lost five galleys. That's kind of painful. Probably with the three star general. Who fights Castile and Aragorn then? Oh, Thoma, nice. Good job, lads. I need to sort out the Venetians after this. Advantage over the Ottomans now. I'm just surprised they still have troops anymore. Well, I'm surprised I still have troops anymore. I mean, it's a separatist. I will die. I want to get another one. 362. A little bit better. And when the navy's out, we enjoy ourselves. Let's get over to Trabzon. Oh, God, I'm missing just enough. Well, this is a predicament to be in. A mountain fort in the Ottomans have trapped me in. Yep. I saw that one coming. This is going to be very painful. We only retreated one province. And they didn't finish us off. Well, ha! Scorching the earth. Works every time. I think this is the piece that I'm happy with. Uh, we take... Uh, Constantinople and Gelabolu because, you know, blockading the strait. I'm sure I can come up with a decent enough navy next time with all of this cash that I've got. Uh, we take the gold mine and a fort over here and then lots of little islands. Obviously, put it on the, uh, put it on the Hungary strat, or the late strat, if you want to call it that. But I think that is where we'll leave it for today. Uh, I would be more than happy to continue this. Uh, as per, ooh, big pleasure. Uh, as per usual, if you do want to see more, then make sure to like and subscribe and, uh, and, and push this video out. Get any sort of traction. I think next steps potentially using French as a battering ram against Castilians to try and secure southern France. At the same time, once the world starts going on, once that war's been won, I'm going to fight the Venetians to break that alliance with France, potentially calling in the Austrians. So then I am able to somehow think about sniping Lucca. Very much enjoy that. If I can just exhaust them enough, that'd be good. And then it's just, it's, it's a series of expanding in the Balkans, expanding in Iberia and expanding in Italy. Am I able to form Italy? I think I can. Oh, I can form Italian nation. Need Firenze, Milan and Genoa. Right. Well, chaps, either way, do hope you enjoyed. If you did, then I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Huge shout out to our patrons, most notably Charlie Demorel, Krilly, Flyerton, JDow52, Cargon, Xiaomi, Lewis Wright, Nicole's Christ, QA Shard, Redguard, and Shadow Singer. Your support means a lot, guys. Whilst you're here, you might as well click on another video. I mean, it's, it's literally right there.